Hello guys, this is Nilesh Kamre from WindowsITExperts.com and in this video we are going to see how to demote domain controller manually. Uh, before that, uh, I would like to say if you like uh, the videos I upload on this channel, so please subscribe to my channel, like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter and follow me on Google Plus and all the links are given in the description below. So let's go to our subject. Uh, <clears throat> to manually demote the domain controller uh, is not a big deal uh, because we have to just uh, do some uh, two to three steps uh, to demote it uh, manually so my one of the domain controller is a down and uh, we don't have to uh, bring it up uh, in the production environment okay so how to demote it manually uh, i go to uh, active directory users and computers go to domain controllers ou DC10, my, the host name of the DC is DC10 in my environment and I have to demote it uh, manually. Okay, so right click on it and just say delete. Are you sure you want to delete this? Click on yes. So this is the demotion process. So delete the domain controller anyway. It is permanently offline and can no longer be removed using the using the removal wizard click delete and click on so this is the give uh, this active directory domain controller is a global catalog do you want to continue this deletion click on yes okay so this has been deleted now let's check uh, our ad sites and services click on refresh now i can see there is no replication topology for this dc10 right click on this server click on delete click on yes and this will give uh, give you the uh, warning that object dc10 contains other objects are you sure you want to delete the object and all of the objects it contains use delete subtree server control click on yes so now the demotion has been done go to dns mjmt.msc then check if any dependencies are there on the on that particular server so i cannot see dc10 in my host record it is uh, it is not there go to sites go to default first site tcp and there is no records in no gc record no ldap no kerbera so srv records are also deleted now click on dc5 go to properties check Oh, just, just hold on. Not here. Okay, name servers. So, uh, click on Windows ID XP domain. Right click on this. Go to properties. Name servers and name servers under the name servers uh, there is a record still record is there dc 10 dot windows dot com so we can delete this as well remove it has been deleted click on apply and okay now check our application So there is only one DC and uh, no other DC is there. The default first site, it has been went to garbage collection. The name is incorrect. This is something different error and we have no other uh, DC in our environment right now. Okay. <coughs> I use DC die command. I 
and I want to check if there is uh, any errors regarding DC 10. Oh. So there are no errors uh, regarding DC 10. So now I do have only one domain controller uh, in my domain. So DC 10 has been demoted and we are done with our task. So if you like this video, please subscribe. Uh, to my channel. Thanks for watching and we'll see in the next video. Bye-bye.